Now Lambert walks into a tackle. Fisher on the up. Ward for it all. Casbolt just... Casbolt, Fisher on the wing. Can the Blues sneak a late one? Good hands. He's been good, Mark. The Premier's 11 goals in this. Ball now. Doherty did nicely. Newman's little one to Fisher works. Got to go back and kick the goal, surely. Yep. Maybe Setterfield shouldn't have called for it, but he was in range. And to go right here for the Blues. Simpson's such a good player. Fisher. Around the body. Cripps has been enormous. Have to keep improving. The great teams. So skillful. Just shoved out of it a bit. So Carlton have done this all without. Well, they hit the scoreboard. They, they've relaxed the moment. Yeah. Still the one we're getting ahead around, isn't it? Yeah. The decision around the ball. Here is an opportunity for Casbolt. Just got underneath it, picked up. Zach Fisher's back in the side. He's snapped and he's goal. Nice reply, Carlton. Just played the one game in season 2020. Zach Fisher had an ankle injury. And that was a harsh. Good deep entry. And Fisher doing what he needs to do. He's been right around the contest, wherever that ball falls. They need to get numbers there, especially on a wet day. There'll be fumbles, little opportunities. He made the most of it. Yeah, missed those three games with the ankle, as you say. Deconing the big fella. Gibbons had Fisher in mind. Duggan, he took on the tackler. What do you make of that, Lingy? Outside. He can keep going as well. He does round the corner. Here comes Bates. Got under Bar Barris there. Little one with the feet. Kept it alive, Eddie. Handball comes. Fisher. Left foot snap. Well done, Eddie Betts. Fisher with the goal. Betts with the good work. Kicked the couple. Has Fisher. And, and hanging in there, but came off the back of a great spoil from Jones in the middle of the ground. Then... When they got the inside 50, Eddie Betts up against Barris. Wasn't going to be able to spoil the ball, but played it smart, played it well, took the body instead, brought the ball to ground. It was made look really good by Noons. Over the top, the Blues on the run. Fisher got the mark here. Duggan no. claims him almost no. 50. Caught a ball, almost been called. Draws to go to Simpson, then goes back on his left. Driving ball, Casbolt. All the way at the moment. Great stuff. Gibbons yeah. kicked the last goal. Wants the goal square. Casbolt, Barris from the side. Now he's a chance. And he's lurking, scrambling, finding a way. Goal coming up. Zach Fisher's got free. It's all come. What about that? Eddie was doing everything he could. And in the end, a third goal for Zach Fisher. Again, it was the deep entry. Nilly from Barris to take the spectacular mark. But look at that, Eddie Fisher all just fighting. Kennedy was there as well. Exciting play from the Blues. And Gaff just couldn't quite force it over the line. The deep entries is what's really helping Carlton. Means if they're able to win it, it's dangerous. If West Coast are winning it back. Kennedy got the boot to ball with good timing at the back. Eddie Betts, here's Fisher, goal number four. Zach Fisher's got four. Hadn't ever kicked multiple goals until today. He's now got four. The formula, reasonably simplistic, long, deep entries to a genuine contest. And the small forwards get there and clean wasn't he off his toes yeah, yeah he's having a ball today a lot of fun and got it right for Koning beautiful tap down here Redden kicks out wide bit of making up for the fact they've been beaten around the ball but good by Cripps there Shepard rare fumble Nelson now Kennedy's in there Nelson again Cole little handball along the line through here to Koning in front Redden now you get boots of ball, I think you've managed tried hard. Mark Murphy, as always, fishing with four goals. Born next week at Optus, and then after that. Through yeah. came Kerno, wobbles it inside, 50 to Fisher. Good man. You probably don't need one, to be fair, boys. Hill to the back. Flying through the screen, Murphy. Eddie Betts so dangerous here. Wilson. Kerno's got a lot of the ball now. Kennedy. Zach Fisher, 
They've played it caught between his legs somehow. Fisher. Chipping kick from behind. Kennedy did well. Brought it to ground. Fisher. Games into him. Charlie Kernow comes back. Future for Carlton fans is pretty exciting now. They go forward again. Fisher did well. Look at move into the middle. Well stayed in. Well done, Gibbons. Fisher. Yeah, a little dance step. And then an end on end. Five. Sonny Walters. Lose do really well. What about Paddy Cripps there? Each player's wanting to win the footy and just it's a bit out of whack there at the moment. Ball from behind, Brennan Cox. who will play the mark here. Yeah. It's a mark. It's a mark. It has to be a mark. Kerno, Duck talked about his form. Picked up by Weller. Had to avoid the oncoming Murphy. Did it well to Wits. Wits to May. Back to Greenwood under pressure. Finding out they can't. He protected it with it. his body, didn't he? Got it to Fisher. It's a likely tight Fisher. Injury sort of brought him back to the field, but he's and legal gives it to Walsh. Walsh, a powerful kick, finds Fisher. Oh. Down it was in the path. Grips is able to clear the ball in the end. Harbrow, the juggler, back in this week after being managed last week. There's Brandon Ellis, haven't seen a lot of him. Fisher did well to try and win the footy then. Gets it to Kerno, that hard running Kerno, left foot down the line. Ball getting over the back now. Fisher's quick, we know that. Really quickly. Lacosis, he runs away from him. Second bounce, he's looking inside. What's he gonna do? Gives it to Betts. Yep, yeah, he's got one. He had to get one tonight and he does. Pretty kick his first goal in over four weeks. But have a look at Lacosis. Remember he was running hard the other way a moment ago. Now he's calling for help. Anyone want to help? Because the big bear, as Duck said, jumped right on his back and said, mate, you've done too much running. <laughs> Built it away there by Graham. Probably could have taken the mark. It's a hard night to do. Gathers tries to get around Bowes. Brandon Ellis with a hand on it. Fisher keeps his feet. Right. Setterfield back to Noons, back to Walsh. Did well. Well, uh, is there any chance of really getting back in the game? Murphy, two of their finest players. Agri Martin at the back was Graham. Actually, Martin did well because I thought he was going to ground. Fisher, Harbrow goes towards the line now. Get it. Thank you, Brandon. Play on. To Koning here. Beautiful left foot slicer to another beautiful left foot in Fisher. Harbrow in the middle of that lot. So, look, there's a big future in this team. Holding the man, Carlton. A big future in both these teams. And, oh, uh, and Carl, uh, point you, Carlton have had some... Uh... Yep. Rankin, little party trip between the legs there. And then centre field to centre half forward, Mackay. Fisher roved it beautifully. Kick to Murphy. The two threes collide. Fisher, little scoop flick. On there, push out. Come on. Chris good, and he backs himself against Adams with the speed towards half forward. It's Fisher. Does he run onto that left of his, decides to... Pull up and look at the next option. Martin's providing the lead. Runs into the space. Good hands the first time and just let it go. Madgen tried to knock it away. Martin back to Fisher. Fisher from 50. Looks towards the square. Doesn't have the distance. Bit fly from Cripps. Mackay, Martin over the top. Bits lurking. Fending off. Clever. Fisher wrong side. No, he doesn't have a wrong side. Goal. I thought he was one-sided, Bruce. Not at all. Happy yep. just to use the right and pull the trigger. The Lockyer tackles up in the in the defensive 50. Eddie Betts, he's that hard to tackle anyway, but smart hands and a, and a nice little step. But looking here at the, at the centre bounce, uh, as we see there, the, the handball from Eddie Betts. We have the centre bounce here from uh, from Collingwood. Elliot, we, we know Collingwood had a lot of injuries. One of Weedering, Weedering one and oh in the end. What a solid citizen he is. Fisher. A little bit of candy to Noble. High ball forward. Doesn't matter. Mason Cox got a fist onto it. Now a chance for Fisher. Tries to get rid of Noble. Gets rid of the quiet. Mackay got his hands on it again. Fisher feeds the handball. Gibbons printing it. Played for the free. Martin got the football. Gave it off to Walsh. Now Fisher. Clever little pass. Can they close the gap with a bit of ball movement here? Danet just went too early. If they played with, they've been brought down. Quainos handball, maybe a turnover. Murphy, clever Fisher. He goes after it in game number 200. Fisher, handball and... 
Green dropped what he normally would have taken. Oh, right on his tail is Murphy. Normally it's the other way around. Now Fisher gets an open, clean look. Eddie. Shaw. Kennedy. Well done, Fisher. In the wrong direction for a moment. Fisher. 50, Mackay. Now Nunes to Fisher. Handy round goals. Nice little dummy. Now the left foot ball. Ooh. Great effort by Malik. It was a good snap. Weedering. Big fly from Alir. Williamson, that's good. Now there's an opportunity for the Blues through Fisher. Injects a bit of speed in the game. Down towards Kasbolt. Gets underneath it. Fisher at the back of the pack. Didn't really have time to dispose of the football. Kerno Fisher. Did really well to just throw it straight on the boot. Some joy for the Blues. Well done by Fisher. And finally, David Roden says Carlton have got their first. Oh, you can just do that, Jase. He's reinvented himself. Yeah. Zach Fisher, yeah. hasn't he? Is that small forward. He, He's made earn his way back into the team, wasn't uh, he? It took him a long time, yeah. Brownie. He, he started out as that quick rebounding defender. They were a little bit worried about some of his ball use at times. Sometimes he was he, he would bite off a little more than he could chew, which isn't necessarily a bad trait, but he's had to work hard to get back in. He looks a very likely type as a small forward. He came back into the side a few weeks back. I think it may, it may have been against Hawthorne in that loss. He kicked four goals. He's the first game up. Fisher bobbles it. Now we get an opportunity to run. He's got some toe. Takes the bounce. Fisher sends it deep to a one-on-one. -on -one. Cripps. Up to eight disposal now, and he's just bullied his way back into the game. He goes forward now. They pumped him forward. Not moving as well. I just wonder whether he's carrying that left knee of his a bit. But Fisher, nice little step. Walsh just toe pokes it forwards towards Fisher. McInerney dives on the footy, needs to get rid of it. And does. Sets a task for Walsh. Fisher, back to Walsh. Fisher, Kennedy shrugs a tackle once, twice. Desperation time on the clock. It runs down. The Blues have come and won. It's out wide. Fisher. For the Adelaide Crows, forcing them very wide so far. Better the players embrace it more. You can see it. Can they steal another one here, Carlton? Hands it out for Fisher. On a half-back flank. Keys corrals him. Let him have a bounce and hit a target. Walsh, give to him to ground. Walsh ducks out a one tackle. Hands it back to Fisher. Drop the share and gets it back again. Murphy steals it back again. Gave it to Fisher and floats it to O'Brien. And he knows time is of the essence. Back into the lineup. First game of this season. For Lockie O'Brien, their pick 10, part of the Bryce Gibbs trade to Adelaide. Again, got them game ball moving forward. And nice little kick there from Fisher. Just saw him out of the corner of his eye. 